What is going on YouTube? Once again, I'm here back with another video. Now we're here back on Madden Mobile 23 and today EA ended up dropping the new Gridiron Guardians promo here in Madden Mobile. So we're going to be taking a look at it and we're going to be seeing what we can complete. No money spent. So make sure to click that like button and subscribe if you guys are new. Turn on notifications so that you guys can be notified whenever I do drop a new video. This is my second upload of the day. If you guys haven't seen my first NBA Live Mobile video, make sure to go ahead and check it out today we're dropping three videos all right so uh my second video was supposed to be a nba 20 uh nba 2k 22 arcade edition video but i hopped on a man of mobile and i saw that they dropped a new promo so this is going to be our second video and then later on we're going to be finishing off the day with a 2k 22 arcade edition video so we're dropping three straight bangers today so make sure you guys have notifications on make sure you guys are subscribed if you guys are not already we are only 170 subscribers away from 95k so let's go ahead and hit that by the end of this month all right we got like nine more days left of this month so we could definitely make it happen all right so let's go over to the campaign and let's take a look at these new masters. So uh, it looks like uh, we ended up getting some make rights here. So due to an issue during release, Gridiron Guardian's daily goals are not tracking for some users. All right. So they're giving us 205 Gridiron tokens and a Gridiron Guardian's uncommon player. All right. So I'll gladly take that. You know what I'm saying? Anything that EA's handed me for free, I'm happy about that. All right. So let's just continue this. So it looks like this promo is set up differently than the last one. So I'm hyped. We get ourselves uh, a rare player right there. And this is going to give us a Gridiron Guardians iconic, not iconic, but uncommon. We get a DeAndre Carter. All right. So we got ourselves uh, a difficulty section right here. So we can either choose the easy, we can either choose medium, or we could choose hard. You already know me. We going straight hard. All right. I ain't playing around. Now, in order to play through the hard mode, uh, you're going to have to have at least a 3,000 overall. All right, my 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 overall is 3,164, so we meet the requirements. All right, so this event right here, let's go ahead and dive into it. We can play this event a total of four times, and the reward. So this gives us 27 gridiron uh, guardian tokens, and then we also get a chance at an uncommon. So we have four. We could play this four times. Let's go ahead and dive into it and let's, let's see what's popping with this event. We are currently using a controller and I think my controller is about to die. So hopefully it doesn't die during this video because that would suck. All right. So for this event, all we got to do is get 50 passing yards. We recently just added DK Metcalf to the squad and Travis Kelsey. So this shouldn't be too difficult. We got Travis Kelsey wide open. Can we get the 50 yards here? We get 24 right there. Uh, let's see. Let's see. Let's hit him with wide receiver corner real quick. And then hopefully we could get the remaining amount of yards here. I'm going to hit RB. Come on, stay in bounds. Oh, let's go, Kelsey. Let's go, Kelsey. Did we beat it? Oh, all right. We're only eight yards short. All right. We'll hit shakes real quick. Looking to hit Kelsey on the post route. Oh, we got Kelsey wide open. Wide open for that pass. All right. So... That event was pretty easy, as you guys can see. None of these events really are too difficult. The only events that I don't like playing are uh, the ones where you gotta start out like in the second half and you gotta win the whole game. Those are the events that just take the longest, but none of these events are pretty difficult. So let's see, right here is the same scenario. All we gotta do is just, uh, you know, we got four, we got four total chances and we gotta get through that. So let's say, we got through the whole thing. Let's see, rewards. This one right here, how much are we getting? Are we getting 300? Oh no, that's 60, all right. So this last event gives us 60. And then what is this up here? Are these the objectives? Okay, so complete the passing and rushing attack goals. That's gonna give us a uh, gridiron uncommon player. So we got a bunch of different objectives that we can complete. That's going to give us additional, you know, Gridiron Guardian items. You know, some of these gives us Gridiron Guardian points. Some of them gives us, you know, like uncommon players. We got this one right here that gives us a rare player. And then to get an epic, 
you complete all of the challenges on a gridiron's hard stage all right so once you go through all of these events you're going to be able to claim all of these rewards from the objective list and these objective lists they refresh every single day all right um we got the gridiron rookie complete all the easy challenges uh gridiron pro complete all the medium challenges and then all pro complete all the hearts pretty much so your main focus right now needs to be getting through all of these events today all right you want to get through all of these events today which shouldn't be too difficult all right and then after that you just want to start auto playing them you know what i'm saying just like any other promo so right here as you guys can see we can start auto playing this event but i do not recommend auto playing any of the events until you have all of the events done you want to play all the events first and then um you know starting tomorrow that's when you want to start auto playing the events but later on today once your program stamina refreshes again that's when you want to start auto playing the events but first like i said you want to get through all of them first so that you can uh you know complete all of the objectives uh let's go over to trades now and basically if you accumulate 500 of these gridiron tokens that's going to give you five of the uncommon so instead of you know having to accumulate 5,000 points you're only going to have to accumulate 500 points in order to get the five uncommons all right um right here you could get an uncommon or better player from uh this set and then from the first set this one guarantees you an uncommon so 100 points will 100 tokens get you an uncommon 200 tokens get you a chance at a epic and then um 500 points get you five uncommons all right and then i'm um, right here you could put in a thousand points and then this one gives you an uncommon or better all right down here to get the rares you have to put in five uncommons And then to get the epics, you need to put in five rares. And then to get the icons, 124 overall, you're going to need to put in five of these epics. All right. So the sets are pretty much the same. It's just the token values are different. And um, I like how EA switched it up with this promo setup. Like they're not making it to where every single promo is the same exact setup. All right. The sets are the exact same, but how you accumulate these items are different with every single promo and I like how EA is doing that. So let's take a look at these masters and let's see which one I want to get, all right? So we got ourselves a 124 overall Randy Moss. We got a Mike Alstock. We got a punter Jake Bailey. We got Jimmy Ward at safety, Tyler Higby at tight end, and Fletcher Cox at D tackle, all right? Now, this is, let's see, how long is this promo is gonna be? Let's see how long this promo is going to be going on for. I think it's going to be a week long promo, if I'm not mistaken. If we go to events, oh, it's two weeks. All right. So this promo lasts two weeks. Okay. So me personally, I'm looking to get two of these 124 overalls. That's going to be my goal for this promo. All right. Since it lasts two weeks, I want to get at least one 124 every single week. All right. So. The players I'm looking to get, I'm looking to get Randy Moss, all right, because we still need one more wide receiver for our flex position, and I feel like we could have Randy Moss and DK Metcalf on the outside, and then I could put Justin Jefferson as our flex wide receiver, all right? So I want Randy Moss, I want Mike Alstop I'll because we do need a fullback, I don't want Jake Bailey, I want Fletcher Cox, and I want Jimmy Ward. All right, so the players I want, you know, we want the safety, we want the D tackle, we want the wide receiver, and we want the fullback, all right? We don't need a tight end, and we don't need a punter, okay? So those are the current masters I'm looking for. I'm thinking after a week goes by, they're gonna drop uh, a couple of more masters that we're gonna be able to get. So by the time they drop the second set of masters, I want to have my first master done. All right, that's going to be the goal. Let me know in the comments down below which one of these icons you guys want. Uh, like I said, me personally, I wouldn't be mad with Moss, Alstock, Cox, or Jimmy Ward. Okay. Now, let me see something real quick. Did they drop any new team of the weeks, if I'm not mistaken? 
uh how many of these do we got we got two of these right here i think they i think they might have switched up the trade-in sets if i'm not mistaken i think i heard something about that let me uh scroll down real quick so iconic offensive select we got the mike gasicki that we could put in here so we just need three more offensive epics to get ourselves in a offensive select pack which would be nice so stay tuned for that now let me see something real quick okay all right so we can't do any of these sets right now let me go to limited time just to see if they dropped any in any new team of the week players uh oh we got a tua we got a tua tonga vailoa and we got a byron murphy so we could definitely use the byron murphy how many epics do we got or how many rares do we got we only got one rare right now so i'm gonna start working towards this brian murphy right here team of the week because we could definitely use another higher overall corner and then um you know the the master here we got an andrew thomas as like the big master so there's that right there all right let me know in the comments if you guys are going for any of these team of the week players but that's pretty much the gist of this new promo um make sure you guys are grinding it and then let me take a look at my league real quick we just won our last league tournament i'm gonna go ahead and kick people out right now all right so let me just well first we gotta claim all this oh we ended up getting a decent amount of weights right there that's what i like to see we lost a tournament lost another tournament Hey, at least we're one and zero in this new uh, season here. So let me take a look at my members. All right, I want to start kicking people out. So manage. All right, let's see. Available, yes. Panda killer. I'm trying to. I think Elijah plays. Or I don't know. I'm gonna do all this off camera. You know what I'm saying? Just uh, comment down below if you guys want to join the league. And uh, I think today I'm going to go, or after this tournament, whoever doesn't play the tournament, I'm going to go ahead and kick them out. And then I'll bring a couple of you guys in. So if you guys want to join the league, it is called Buck Nation. Uh, just make sure to comment down your username. And then once I kick people out, I'll go ahead and send you an invite to the league. And then you'll be able to join the league. So that's pretty much the gist of the new Gridiron Guardians promo. It's a very straightforward promo. Uh, what you guys want to accomplish by the end of today is you want to get all of the events done by the end of today All right, so that after today you can just log on you can auto play the best events That's going to give you the most rewards. All right, and then you can start working towards your Grand Iron Guardians master All right, my goal for this promo is to get two of these masters. All right, that's going to be my goal Let me know in the comments down below what you guys are shooting for all right, this is what the team is looking like. In our last episode, we ended up grabbing the Dak Prescott. Ain't we grabbed Travis Kelsey for the team? Uh, the defense looks the same. Honestly, we added the Camu Gruger Hill uh, team of the week recently, but that is really the only new upgrade we made on defense. So I'm looking to get the Fletcher Cox or the strong safety out of this promo. Uh, it would be nice to get both of those guys as my two players from this promo So let me know in the comments how you guys' teams are looking What's your overall and let me know which masters you guys are going for All right, so that's gonna wrap it up for this video If you guys did enjoy make sure to click that like button and subscribe if you guys are new Turn on notifications so that you guys can be notified whenever I do drop a new video Stay tuned. I got another video dropping later on today. That video is going to drop later on tonight, though. It's either going to drop at like 10, 11 p.m., something like that, close to midnight. But hey, you know what I'm saying? This is a triple upload day. If you guys haven't seen my NBA Live Mobile video, make sure to go ahead and check it out. All right. So, yep, drop a like on this video. Subscribe if you guys are new. Y'all know the slogan to the haters. I'll see you guys later. Peace out.